I am showing the green arrows to make way on this human's back, but I it's just sitting in unfinished drafts. So as you can see here, I'm trying to move the body over, but I have the joint, that little circle there, just the joint and so the body's moving. So basically if I put it at like the elbow, it would move at the elbow. So I'm wanting to move more like the entire body's moving. I don't know why I put legs there when it will be entirely seen. Usually you do that with a shorter one. When the dress skirt's shorter or something. So, this is just me moving. I'm probably not going to talk the entire time. I did one voice with <laughs> Did not work out. So, moving the body here. Um, so, a little bit. Um, alright, now because we're moving the body here and I do not feel like speeding this one through the entire process. This is me just doing one body. It's not me going through like an entire thing. This is me doing, leaning forward. Leaning backward. You'll probably hear me moving my hair. I am so sorry. Okay. So. I have right now just for this example. Just because I did not feel like. Low enough. Oh not much separately. I just have both joints connected at the shoulders. So the arm moves in one. So basically what's going to be happening here. Put your arm straight out in a straight line. And then move it up. You have your elbow. On. Your shoulder and hand and arm, lower arm together. Yeah, that's what's happening here. Um, that's me trying something. I want to figure out how to do better tweening on the arm and shoulder so they match up more. That's a problem I currently face on this app. On this app in particular. I do not use all right motion. This is Cuca. Purely Cuca. That's where I pretty much do all my tweening. On here. I will be talking back. Actually, when I was doing this, I think I was a little bit, but it does not pick up the audio. I need the audio. I'm not sure if I'm even being loud enough. When you move the head, um, after I move this one arm, I'm just it's a little odd at times when I'm doing it. I'm looking back, so don't just tween all at once. So you want to make sure you're tweening, you're looking, you're tween apart, and see how it looks. Apart, see how it looks. So basically, if I'm going to move the head forward, I'm going to want to see you and make sure the head, the head just not going like in a straight line like how I walk. Time to like the 88, if it's in the 88 for thing thing, try to thing, um, yeah, we don't want it looking like that, because that's a little bit, it does happen sometimes, occasionally when you're not that up, but the body go forward, it looks kind of weird. Um, I do it sometimes, all the time. So, you want to make it look like, at least for this is a human character, so I'm going to look. When I went to the robot, um, I used different ones. I used to use actually different motions of those. Oh, um, the easing type. Change the easing type. That way it lines up better and make sure if you have like a shoulder doing one easing type, you want your lower arm to do the same one. Um, so different easing types can get you different results, like the bounce or electric one, a just an easing type, is going to give you more of, a, of one that's going to bounce, like, I use that for robots sometimes. Um, the circular one is the one here, it's going to be circularly smooth, it's going to be smooth. Oh, I used out, because we want the body moving outwards. If you do in, it's at the beginning, and then in, out, it does it both times. I don't recommend using that one. I really use out, and sometimes I use in. Um, what are the other ones? There's one more. The other one that's below this one. Um, give me a second, I gotta read what it says. I'm in the other easing type. Um, it's gonna give, I, I don't even catch the name, it's also gonna be like one and it's gonna be like go back and then it's gonna go a little bit past where it is and back. So it's gonna give you different results on how, so a bounce one might be good for like something falling in the ground and bouncing back up. A sick one might be good for like an arm swinging forward, forward and then bouncing, so, or an arm swinging back and bouncing. Uh, going bouncing. Um, I don't use the in out very often. I'm not sure how the in out looks. Experiment, see which one do you type. I use mainly this one. 
but stack up more. <laughs> and um, the other one, and um, what's it called? I'm gonna post the video so you can see it. Um, I can say smooth. I don't know. I didn't quite catch it. But that third one, I use that one a lot too. Um, you I hear me adjusting my headphones. <laughs> but that's how I do different kinds of I have been talking five minutes. I can't believe that. It's actually five and a half minutes, more like six. But this is how I do it. I'll leave you to silence the rest of the time. Um, I'm probably not going to use any auto captions. If you want me to use auto captions, captions, um, comment about it, upload a version with auto captions. I'm not doing captions. It's all. Bye.